All right, everyone. Well, I just want to take a moment, Brad, to thank you and your yeah. team. Um, what a night. And, you know, we hate breaking into programming. We hate having severe weather, too. <laughs> oh, we do. It's so important to, to talk yeah. through these things. And we've been watching this system for about a week, and it, yeah. it panned out. I mean, Good. last week it was these baby rope tornadoes. Everybody's like, yawn. This was a, the real deal. I mean, we had severe weather. Yeah from uh, basically from Nebraska all the way through Iowa along I-80. Let's talk about it here. I want to show you those tornado reports again because they were long lived tornadoes, long track tornadoes out in western Iowa. Then we had a little bit of that here in central Iowa. Not as big, not as bad, but these were the worst ones out here. And then we had these. And of course, they'll go out and survey the damage to see how many tornadoes exactly we had. I'm guessing it was at least dozens of tornadoes. A closer look here around the metro, and you can see this is the one that was coming up toward the metro and got very close. We had a warning for the uh, basically West Des Moines and that area, and that one fizzled out. Thankfully, no reports of any damage there. This one redeveloped, came in, and uh, in the east side had some reports of damage there. So yeah, we've had a busy, busy day and a busy night. So here are the thunderstorms now. The yellow areas, the tornado watch till midnight. It's just kind of a safety procedure. We're going to watch these. Chris is still here watching and we'll keep an eye on things here for a couple more hours or at least another hour. And you can see Ankeny is getting some heavy rain right now, a little bit of lightning and thunder, but this is mostly just good rainfall out there. And that's one thing we've had. We turn our attention to Saturday and there will be a chance for severe weather. Primarily it's going to be southern Iowa, south central, southwestern Iowa. That's what the Storm Prediction Center has. And we're in a low risk for any tornadoes here. I think southwest Iowa probably has the best chance and better chance down into Kansas. And then we go to Sunday. And we've got a slight risk in southeast Iowa. We're in a marginal risk here, so I think it's going to get less and less each day. Today was the worst. Looking at lightning on the Sky Tracker 5 right now, 63 degrees. Rain is imminent here in uh, most of Des Moines as that rolls in. Temperatures are actually pretty warm now. They were cool all day, but we made it to 66 degrees before the first thunderstorms. And you can see the winds are coming out of the south now, and that's going to keep us warm overnight. Set the stage for a warm day tomorrow and it's actually going to be warm and humid tomorrow. We've got temperatures in the 60s. It'll stay that way most of the night. We may get down to the 50s, but look at these dew points. This is that uh, air coming in from Missouri right now, and it's fairly humid. So our big low is moving out, but guess what? It has a brother low. It has another low following it that's going to trail almost the same path and try to do this all over again this uh, weekend. So there's our low moving through. That energy will leave the atmosphere. The next one moves in. So watch on Futurecast. Those move out pretty quickly tonight. We have a quiet Saturday morning, early afternoon, no problem. So we get to about 4 or 5 o'clock, and that's when things start to go here. 5 o'clock, thunderstorms developing. They're not as organized as they were today. Could be some isolated severe weather here in southwest Iowa, south central Iowa, and then we move into southeast Iowa through the evening hours. So mainly southern Iowa tomorrow. We'll, we will see more rainfall from this. Now going into Sunday, less activity even on Sunday, scattered showers and thunderstorms. Something may become severe here in western Iowa, but it's just not as strong of a low on Sunday as what we had today. Rainfall, it just depends where the thunderstorms are. You can see some areas could get three inches. This is additional rainfall and in some areas could get a half inch or an inch. So storms early tonight. We will be staying warmer and more humid, low near 58. Tomorrow, thunderstorms developing in the afternoon, especially in southern Iowa, and we will see uh, quite a bit of showers and thunderstorms into Sunday as well. Here's your 10 day forecast. It will be getting better on Monday. Tuesday looks like a quiet day, but again, another round of thunderstorms. I don't think it'll be severe, but Tuesday night into Wednesday, another chance of some rain. Thursday, a chance of rain. It looks very active, and unfortunately, those <laughs> those that warm weather, those warm days we had next week, they are slipping away. It's going to get cooler. Yeah, look at that. All right.